Hello there, everybody. I'm Mr. Gunpie. This is Let's Play Sonic Lost World Part 5. And here we go. Into the third zone of this area, Frozen Factory. Last time, we learned that Robotnik really does not like those Zeddy, man. He is having serious problems with them. And now we have a carnival type area, so that's nice. Yeah, we've got egg ponds and stuff. What? Okay, this is kind of weird. So far, I'm not really liking the uh, levels in this world. Not a big fan. Come on! You need to stop spin dashing whenever I let go of the button and hold backwards at the same time. And you, I don't need you, wing thing. Wait, wait. Uh, there are lots of chips in this area. Let's see what happens if I grab like a lot of them. And by a lot of them, I mean like almost all of them. Oh, there's a dice following me now. Well. The dice is kind of annoying. It gets in the way of the camera. Huh. Looks like we got more lasers to worry about. Let's try to just... There we go. Red ring. All right. Are these where all the chips go? Yep, they do. I'm guessing I get to go to a special awesome place. Where? Oh, there. Okay, Sonic's in the corner. Oh, yeah. I'm guessing this means that I get to go on a good path path where things try to roll on top of me, of course. Oh, I can... Ah, interesting. Whoa! I did not see that coming. Just trying to figure out all the gimmicks of this level. Oh, and it's a game over, boy. I did not realize that I ran out of that many lives, but then again, that last level was particularly annoying. I didn't get really get that far in this level, so I may as well just keep it. Let's not spin dash everywhere. Hmm. Let's see here. Oh, the... Oh, those hurt me. Deep dice hurt me. I did not know that. Ah. Uh, keep running into things. No, I don't want to bounce this way. I want to go up. Ah, huh, it appears that that's not happening. Oh well, let's see what's over this way. Huh, got more chips. Ah, no, I did not want to do that at all. Okay. Oh. Didn't see this last time. As for those enemies, I just sort of ignore them now. They aren't worth it. Alright, gang, let's do this again. Alright, what do we got? 
ridiculousness, that's what we've got. It's a Sonic game, so what else would you expect? Oh, apparently I got something. Come on. There we go. Almost. Oh, yeah, that's where I wanted to go. Ow. Ah, there we go. That's what I was supposed to do. Uh... Three, two, one. Hmm. Whoa! Am I going to a bonus area? Yeah, I guess I am. Nice. Whoa. This level is kind of crazy. Oh, that's bad. Wait, is that death? Oh! That's death! This reminds me too much of the Sonic Heroes level. The, um... Then again, I guess it's supposed to be more like Carnival Night Zone, but it's not really like Carnival Night Zone. Whoa! Rings! If only those really... If only high numbers of those really mattered in this game. Also, does it appear that I can actually move myself? No! Come on. Here we go. Whoa, that was a bumper. Come on. Guys! Ah! Ah! No! Sonic! Would you please stop coming back down here? I want you to go up. No! Ah! Sonic? You're gonna go up. Up. Let's see what we get. That's pretty good. Where's the exit to this thing? Oh, nice. Do I just need to, like, get a certain number of rings to leave? Ah. I'm probably just gonna cut some of this stuff out, because it's like, gee whiz. This is just annoying, guys. This is worse than the second boss of Sonic CD. Come on. Here we go. That's not where I wanted you to go. Well, there's another ring jackpot. Is it basically just guaranteed for you to get a jackpot in these things? And another jackpot. This is not how real casinos work. You never get jackpots in those. <sighs> yep, no tails jackpot. Oh no, it's a Robotnik, guys! Oh hey, finally! I'm going up. And of course not. 
Isn't there anything that I can do to speed this process up? Like, right now, it's just being ridiculous. I can't move up! This is the worst part of the game so far. I don't necessarily mean just this part, but I mean the, the entire ice world so far. It's been the worst part of the game. Oh, there's a red ring up there. Maybe I can get it. Finally, I'm out. Okay. Let's never do that again. Oh, that's interesting. No, nope. Sonic, get over there. You know, I get the feeling that the reason why the first one was so easy... ...was because I had all those tokens, and it filled it all the way. And as a result, it gave me an easier time. Finally! Oh, thank you. Let's just... In this world. Okay, guys. Hopefully this world, this next level, won't be as annoying. So yeah, I probably just cut out, like, a bunch of minutes or something. Move it or lose it, Snow Cone! The last time we met, you ruined my nail art. Oh no. Now I have to reapply a whole new coat. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Mm -hmm. I am so, so sorry. Oh, well, in that case... Oh no, what I meant to say is, I'm so sorry that you have nothing more important to do in life. Oh, you're gonna pay for that! As soon as my nails dry. Gee whiz. All right, moving onward. All right. Wait, Frozen Factory wasn't that a Banjo Kazooie um, Grundy's Revenge level? I think it was. No, wait, that was the Frozen Furnace. Never mind, I'm being ridiculous again. Uh, Sonic, that's not what I want you to do. Oh, these guys back from Metropolis Zone! Oh, these guys hurt you now. That's important to know. Whoa there, don't you diss the shoes, lady. These shoes are the epitome of cool. And again, I'm no fashion fashionista, I don't know. Maybe they're like not or something. That that sounds completely ridiculous to me. So anyway, I just died again because that's kinda what you do in this game. Ah, uh, come on! Well, I only have one life left, so let's make it count. So yeah, apparently if you die enough times in a section, that little capsule with the wing appears. Because they think that you suck too much, basically. <sighs> okay. Sonic, I need you to jump whenever I press the button. Uh, oh no! That's a game over. Okay. 
Right, um, I'll see you guys back where I was, probably, unless it was just like a really short distance. Move it or lose it! Alright, I think I'm about back where I was. Whoa. And, uh, yeah, here we are, doing stuff. Because that's what you do in video games, you do stuff. Yeah, this is it. This is where I died. Woo! Let's... What? No, I jumped, guys! You saw that I jumped over that. It's completely ridiculous what you're trying to pull there. Wow! So it, I was about to go to the next section. Oh, oh, it's these little blob guys back from Chemical Plant Zone again. They like taking stuff from Chemical Plant Zone. Oh no, it's more Kirby 64 type stuff. Yeah. Here we go, now I can climb across the ceilings. I knew that I could do that. Come on, Sonic, climb, climb, climb! Oh yeah, now you can drop. What? That's not even cool. Alright, orbs, there you go. Come on, Sonic, you've got this. You've got all of the this! There you go! That's how you get past all that stuff. Just doing a spin dash alone isn't gonna cut it. Oh, right. Running. And skating. And ice physics. So this is why they never put ice physics in Sonic games. It's annoying! Oh no! Wait, wait, guys. There we go. What do we have next? We have balls. More balls. Mega balls. Come on, Sonic, you can do this. What? Uh, okay. Okay, I'm alive. Are we going all Metropolis Zone on? Oh no, we are. This is exceedingly Metropolis Zone. Oh. Rings. Those are going to become bombs in a second, though, I'm quite certain. Yeah, there's you. That, that's not what's... No. Here we go. Oh, lots of animal capsules there. Gonna want those. Alright, let's see if I can handle this. Going up here. Whoa! No! No, no, no! I did not mean to press that button. I was just sort of like putting my finger down a little bit, letting it rest. But no, that did not work at all. Alright, alright, another checkpoint. More rings, I bet I'm gonna fight Xena now. Or not, more crushers.
Oh, wait. Oh, that's that's an endless pit. Never mind then. I'll just move onward. Yeah. This is some pretty cool stuff, but it's mostly automated, so I'm not really doing a whole lot. Kind of bothers me. Well, Sonic, I know that you can target onto her. Sonic, why aren't you doing it? Oh, come on, you just did it! What? What's wrong? Why won't you target her? Now you wouldn't hurt a lady, would you? Maybe if I just walk around. Yeah! Yeah, he'll target her if he's just walking around, but not if he's running around. There we go, target her three levels. That's it! That's the entire boss battle! Well, there's that. That's cool. Not entirely sure how much I'm going to cut out, but, um... You know, there will probably be stuff, so I'll probably do another level. I am getting tired of lugging your head around, pal, so I made you a snowbot body. <laughs> I can't feel my legs! <laughs> True! Your robots are a reflection of your genius, Dr. Eggman. But this does give me an idea! I think I know a way to cause the lost hex to implode using no gravity effects. We could destroy the Zeti in one quick stroke. And exterminate every living thing around them. Are you out of your mind? Of course, there'd be some collateral damage, but... Collateral damage? What kind of monster... Tails! I'm sorry. I suddenly felt very mean. Not the best idea to put the dimwit's head on a battle bot. In hindsight, I gotta agree with you, Doc. Thanks for the save. Um... Can you get off me now? I can't <laughs> figure you out. One second you're contemplating genocide, and the next you're saving one of your worst enemies. I'm a complicated guy. And you? <laughs> what were you thinking, Tails? You could have gotten yourself killed. I was just trying to help. This is a very interesting uh, story that they've got here, actually. All right, one more level for this time, and is this... It looks like another Green Hill Zone type level. It's Silent Forest. Oh, it's a forest. That's still green, but okay. Sonic is more formidable than I anticipated. Yes, he would make a powerful slave. Eggman taught us how to make robots. So we'll make the Hedgehog a robot. Excellent plan, Master. I'm sure you would have thought of it yourself. Given time and time. Something Sonic is running out of. Oh, man. It'll be like Metal Sonic all over again. Alright, so Silent Forest. Let's see what's going on here. Hmm. Okay, no, this is not like the first world at all. Even if the um, area kind of looks like it back on the map area. Oh man, we got robot crocodiles. I don't remember those appearing in any other games. Oh man, it's like the piranha infested swamp waters of Bubble Gloop Swamp. 
But yeah, the different ways they take each uh, area in the game is very interesting, and what am I doing here? Not that. Nope. Maybe like that? Nope. Nope, not like that. That's a game over, isn't it? Yeah, okay, let's try that again. I'm gonna have to grind for lives off screen again. And yeah, we already saw this. I wonder who will be fighting this time. Considering the name Silent Forest, I think that it'll be the emo-ish one. Ah, no, I did not want to jump off of it like that. Ooh. I know that there was a spring on top there, but I can't seem to reach it. Oh, there we go. That's how I do that. I gotta do the kick, and then the homing attack after that. That works. Gee whiz. Enemies that need the kick often don't seem to really display anything about it. At least it isn't very evident. Oh, there we go. Flower to the next area! What do we got? It's... stuff. Oh. Thanks, flowers, for opening up. Well, this is nice. Oh, it's the mole enemies from Mushroom Hill Zone. Oh boy, it's Eagle. Yeah, I have to like tilt the control pad in such a way that no, Eagle, you're going the wrong way. I was trying to tilt it in such a way that he would go up, but it wasn't doing that. Here we go. Let's go the red path, because that's obviously the way to go. What? Sonic, you need to jump! Sonic! Sonic, you need to you need to hit the thing! Why are you not doing that, Sonic? Whoa! Whoa. Mushroom. Here we go. Whoa! This is some pretty crazy stuff right here. Hey, wait, I feel like I've gone around this path before. Let's... let's go this way this time. Does that kill me? Okay, no, it just hurts me. Sonic! What's wrong with you? Why aren't you going... Why are you making it open? Sonic, get off the... Get off the mushroom! There we go. Don't eat the mushroom, Sonic. It's not good for you. Oh, this is cool. Oh no, this is bad. Sonic.
Sonic, get out of there! There we go. No, no, Sonic, Sonic, get off the mushroom, get off the mushroom, get off the mushroom! Maybe I need to use the bounce attack some more. Here we go. Seems to help. Getting stuff open. There we go, got some more rings. Got some more death. Finally, off that planet. <sighs> What's next? Oh, more of these guys. There we go. Is it really just the same planet again? Because that's kind of boring. Just a little bit, guys. Yep, it's the same planet again. I don't know, the, the earlier levels seem to be a lot better. These last, uh, this entire last world has been lackluster, but this level isn't exactly improving things much. Um, okay, just cutscene, basically. Here we go. Alright, guys. I think that's about it for this episode. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back and grind for some lives. Maybe do some time trials on a couple episodes or something. Hmm, something's not right. Huh, must have missed this one. Sonic, it's a trap! Rotten, sneaky! Tails acted for the greater good. Let's make sure his sacrifice isn't for nothing. I'm supposed to be the fastest, but I was too slow to save my buddy. Wow. You know, IGN, whenever they reviewed this thing, said that the, the story was horrible. Like some stupid Saturday morning cartoon, but this... I think this might be one of the most emotional Sonic games so far. I mean, nothing is trumped with the scene in Sonic Adventure 2 where Sonic goes kaboom, but... It's... it's more consistently serious, it seems. So yeah, with that said, I've been Mr. Game and Pie. This has been Let's Play Sonic Lost World Part 5, and next time, Silent Forest Zone 2. I'll see you guys later!